The Ninth World Science Fiction Convention, also known as No Lake and I, was held 1 to 3 September 1951 at the St. Charles Hotel in New Orleans, Louisiana, United States. The chairman was Harry B. Moore. The guest of honor was Fritz Lieber. Total attendance was approximately 190. The at the door membership price was $1, the same price charged from the 1st through the 12th Worldca. Other pros attending included Robert Bloch, Frederick Brown, Judith Merrill, E. E. Smith, L. Sprague de Camp, editor John W. Campbell, and fantasy artist Hannes Bock, who did No Laken's program book cover. Famous fans present included Sam Moskowitz, Wilson Tucker, aka Bob Tucker, Dave Kyle, Roger Sims, Terry Carr, and Lee Hoffman. The latter, editor of the very popular fanzine Quandary, whom everyone assumed was male, turned out to be a young woman, a revelation which greatly startled even those who had corresponded with her. Notable events included world premiere screenings of The Day the Earth Stood Still and When Worlds Collide, plus a continuous two-day-long party in Room 770 at the St. Charles Hotel that became legendary following the convention not only for its duration but for its high quality. Mike Glyer's long-running newszine file 770, named in commemoration of this party, has won the Hugo Award for Best Fanzine a number of times. Hugo Awards were not presented at this Worldcar as the awards were not proposed until the following year, 1952, with the first Hugos actually presented in 1953 at the 11th World Science Fiction Convention. However, in 2001 at the 59th World Science Fiction Convention held in Philadelphia, a set of Retro Hugo Awards were presented to honor work that would have been Hugo eligible had the award existed in 1951. A «Certificate of Merit» was presented to representatives of the day the Earth stood still by the Nolakan I chairman, and this was reported on Movietone News at the time. Topic in science fiction culture. No Laken is a plot point in the case of the Little Green Men, the first novel by Mac Reynolds, which is set in part at Ancon, a fictional version of the Tenth World Science Fiction Convention held in 1952. The real Tenth Worldca, held in Chicago, had no actual name like Ancon being simply called, in its own publications, the 10th Annual World Science Fiction Convention, and once as, the 10th Annual Science Fiction Convention, likely a dropped word linotype operator's typo. Before and during the convention, its attendees often referred to it as, Chacon 2. An unofficial nickname that stuck to this Chicago Worldca in the decades that followed. Topic. See also World Science Fiction Society